Hey trendsetters, welcome to another Teen Talk Tuesday with the girl Mena Shashante. Today we're going to be talking about controlling relationships. Now a lot of times in relationships there are little signs of abuse that go on that we totally ignore in the beginning because we just think they're little innocent problems that are going to fade away as the relationship grows. But the truth is if you let those problems sit there, they're going to, they're going to get bigger and bigger bigger and bigger until they get so out of hand you're not going to be able to control them anymore little things like your boyfriend or your girlfriend threatening to leave you if you don't do what they say little things like your girlfriend crying all the time and having temper tantrums because you won't buy her what she wants and you won't do what she wants a little signs in the beginning of the relationship that you ignore that shows you you should have gotten out of that relationship before it grew into something that you never would have imagined in the beginning that it would have got into these little things in the beginning that just like their girlfriends when your girlfriend just threatens to leave you for silly reasons or when your boyfriend pulls your arm people never would have expected for those tiny little things to turn into full on physical, sexual, or verbal abuse. That's why you need to stop these things in the beginning of the relationship before they get totally out of hand and before you get overwhelmed with these problems. There have been so many cases where those little things have went on in the relationship and the parents have saw them and tried to talk to their kids. And by then, the teens are so engulfed or into the relationship, they're not even thinking about leaving. The abuser has already gotten to the victim's mind. And I've seen so many cases where the abuser has actually convinced the victim to somehow kill their parents or their friends or their grandparents, saying they're just trying to get in between their relationship or they have so much control over them they got them to harm the people that they love this is why you nip certain things in the bud because and then later on I've seen these girls or these boys saying they don't know why in the world they did what they did but that person had so much control over them that they actually was like putty in their hands and they did it anyway that's why you nip things in the bud in the beginning of the relationship if you see signs of an abusive or if you see signs of a controlling relationship even little smallest things like somebody breaking or threatening to break up with you if you don't give them your virginity or if you don't wear what they tell you to wear if you don't buy what they tell you to buy you need to cut off the relationship immediately